Hey, it's Chala, and I'm just fucking stalking some marathon runners here. I'm in Russia right now, so you're supposed to turn right from there. You're not supposed to keep on running, dude. Everyone else turn right. You're starting to realize you would have had to. Ch yeah. <laughs> oh, I think this is like the orientation thing where you just have to read the map and like. Whoever gets to the all the checkpoints first is the winner, or some shit like that. Oh shit, they're taking a selfie. Yeah, tighten your pants, dude. What the hell, is there like a fucking rope between those people? What's going on here? Okay, damn. Sick. What you just saw was just some quality footage of me testing out a new camera with good zooming abilities. So if I ever need to do winter sports casting again, I'll have some good hardware for that. But anyway, I made this video about like two months ago where I drew some weird ass stuff that a generator from generatorland.com suggested me. I chose the first Sona generator because it was the highest rated one on the site and it was just so random. XD. The idea of the video was pretty good, but the execution, not so good. So I'm heading back to the generator line today to find some weird stuff to draw. Am I seriously getting an ad for fucking Facebook here? Not even a specific thing on Facebook, but just the actual site? Seriously? Donald Trump slogan generator. Make Trump bottled water great again. Make inherited wealth great again. Make misogyny great again. <laughs> God damn it, man. What else interesting might we see? Fuck off, Facebook. The fake girlfriend generator. Okay, that seems pretty cool. Maybe that's something I could actually draw. Majored in occupational therapy, suffering from yellow fever. Met her in an alley. Hipster vampire baby name generator. Why is there like a picture of some fedora dude here? I'd say this is more like of a Reddit user generator. <laughs> Vampires are big money these days. They're on TV, in movies, in books, and in your closet everywhere. And so are urban hipsters. So if you want to give your child the best of both worlds, you'll need to come up with a hipster vampire baby name. Okay, dude, this is th this looks like the furthest thing away from my vampire hipster, but okay. Kingston Comiaga. Comiaga. Nito. <sighs> Personal bio generator. Won several awards for importing bacon worldwide. Spent the better parts of the 90s promoting Virgin Mary figurines in Washington, D.C. <laughs> Holy shit. At the moment, I'm researching squirt guns in Pensacola. Developed several new methods for creating marketing channels for heroin in the government sector. Spent a year developing strategies for catfish in Phoenix, AZ. At the moment, I'm researching banjos in Salisbury. Holy fuck, this is, this is genius, dude. I'm gonna copy this. Let's go to my Instagram real quick. Alright, dude. Edit profile. Bio. Digital artist and YouTuber. What the fuck was I thinking when I wrote this here? This is... This is what I need. Fuck off, dude. I want to... Okay, let's take the most boring parts out of here. This is a fucking genius description. I don't want to take anything out of here. Maybe I should put it somewhere else. Let's put it on my DeviantArt. Alright, let's do this. Okay, dude. No, nah, no, that's it. That's it. That's what I'm talking about right here. Right here. Oh. Well, that's what I'm talking about right there. Mm -hmm. Let's check whatever. Uh, Facebook status generator. Missing a lousy train station. I can't stand moronic fashion. <laughs> I know way too much about smelly do-gooders. Okay. People watching at a memorable zoo. I'm attracted to erotic nuns? Holy shit. Might as well put a gun sexual in the title of this video. I mean, that'd be a good excuse for that, right? My best friend can't get enough of a pair of breast implants. One of my Facebook friends traded a joke for a bedpan. Okay. <laughs> Holy fuck. Okay. I get it. Traded a joke for a bedpan. That's gonna be my status, dude. Let's get on Facebook real quick. I forgot that I don't have a Facebook page. Uh. I have to find something that I could actually like draw because this is supposed to be the point of this video, dude. 
Monster Girl and Boy Generator. Sucker Free Fawn Girl who wears stunner shades and likes closet. Likes closet. Okay, that seems interesting to say the least. Alright, we're off to a good start. I think. You know these fawn girls? They're like the most generic fantasy artwork characters ever. Might as well get some generic MMO female armor up in here. She was supposed to be sucker free? I don't even know what that means, dude. Being sucker free means that no one can talk shit, cause only you know that there ain't anything that they could talk about. Wouldn't smoke that shit in the SFC, don't give me no Bama weed. Okay, so how the fuck would I interpret that then to my drawing, though? Like, this is so unbelievably unfunny that you would just laugh at the shitty attempt to be funny and not the actual joke. Looking good. Let's draw some saliva here to make it look like real hentai, just to really seal it, you know? Bizarre giant girl who wears lingerie and dislikes garlic. This sounds like some fetish art or some shit, dude. Something that I would find on the newest section in DeviantArt, man. Let's do this shit. I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna do like a sky, city skyline here to give off that Attack and Titan vibe, you know? I forgot to add hair. What do you think? No hair is actually like a pretty good solution to the uh, bizarre part in the description. Lol. I fucking hate drawing legs. So one punch. Anime meme. Anime meme. Pompos. How the fuck do you say this thing? Pompous. Fallen angel. Girl who wears a crown and thinks about fairies. Holy shit, dude, we're going straight back to like 2006 here. Okay, so I guess I now know what this means. I'm gonna give this fallen angel girl. I'm gonna give her an emo outfit of sorts. Let's do like a generic anime face here. Like something you would find if you typed in how to draw anime girl to Google. Actually, why the fuck am I not doing that right now? Oh my god. Oh uh, hell yeah, this is perfect, dude. That's what I'm talking about right there. This is like a children's like a children's Bible illustration or some shit. Let's make everything black for that. You know, 2007 vibe. <laughs> I don't know, dude. This is still lacking something. A, a Facebook life code would surely spice this piece up. <laughs> Click here for full resolution. Don't you fucking love when this happens? Actually... <laughs> actually, this is fucking perfect, dude. Functional elf functional. Functional. Okay. Functional elf boy who wears a lab coat and dislikes Barry. Dislikes Barry. Is that... Uh, what the fuck is... Uh, 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 is uh, okay, first of all, let's deal with the functional part. Okay, some stock images and clip parts and shit. Nothing special to see here, I think. Functional fitness. This gives me an idea, dude. He's gonna be fucking ripped, bruh. I'm gonna give this guy, like... The most generic anime guy face ever, you know, with this particular head shape and these, and these like long thin eyes and these thin straight eyebrows. I want to give him the most unlikable appearance, so let's do some green hair, multicolored hair. Hell yeah, dude! I could easily become a yaoi artist like this. Get your fucking berries out of my gym. I don't know, I just needed a solution to the it doesn't like berries or whatever part. Thoughtful stomach mouth girl who wears lots of hair barrets and wants peen. Wants peen. Is that like a slang for something? A slang for something inappropriate? Okay, so it would appear that stomach mouths are actually a thing? Okay, okay. Art is completely subjective, this is not hurting anyone. All art has the same value. So for the thoughtful part, I'm just gonna do the thinking emoji hand here, lol. I'm an emoji. Since anime is already the recurring theme here, I'm just gonna do some of that anime hair again. Actually, why? 
She was she was supposed to be wearing like lots of hair birds or whatever. That's perfect. I just realized what I've been doing wrong this entire time. Monster girls and boys, like mainly monster girls, I haven't seen any monster boys around, but whatever. They don't have like normal skin tones, they're like blue and green, and they can be made of like slime and shit. God damn it, dude. <laughs> I think I just unintentionally made like a Papa Smurf gender bend. Alright, I do think I've done the world a favor today by making these things come into existence. Maybe sometime someone will find these drawings and think that they're actually serious artworks. So yeah, follow me on MySpace, follow me on Grindr, follow me on uh, Google Plus, and yeah, shout out, bye.